Props, what's it called again? Holy shit. Props, rock, you, okay, rock, you and roll. You tell me what it's called. Props, rock, roll, rock and roll. Rock. Fender, rock and roll, Fender. roll. No. Well, okay, wait, what, what is it called? Wait, tell me, what's it called again? It's not easy to say, so tell me, what what is it exactly called? I, I know, it's harder than it seems, but it's Fender Rock and Roll Road Fools. No, no. Catapult. And Props has something to do with it, but the main thing is, it's Fender. Rock and Roll Fender, Road Fender, Props, Road Fools, Rock and Roll Tour. Knows it's is that right? It's Leave it to Pudger. All right, well, what, what, say it one more time. Fender, Props, Road Fools, Rock and Roll Tour. I almost messed that one up. <laughs> Whatever he said, that's what we're at right now. RideBMX.com, Catfish Year, Props, Road Fools Day 4. We're headed to Nashville. Last night we shredded the complex known as Ramp Riders in St. Louis, Missouri. All kind of crazy stuff went down. We've got a bunch of the boys here. You can see Morgan sleeping. I'm going to pass the microphone around and get each one of these guys' opinions on what they thought of last night. And we're going to start out first with Mr. Adam Banton. Hey, can I, can I hold this? Um, last night was real fun. The park was awesome. Last night was really fun. Uh, it's the first time I'd been there, and I was looking forward to it. I heard really good things. Um, tons of good locals, really, really, really good riders. Um, everybody, I don't know, too many to explain. Lots of crazy stuff went down. I'm sure everybody will talk about it sooner or later. Um, uh, music wise, um, I think it was cool. Like uh, where the bands played, it was it was pretty much like a stage with a wedge in front of it, you know. And uh, everybody sounded good. Uh, me and Bruce played, and I think it was the most dialed time that we played that night. Um, I didn't mess up bragging. Here we go. We're recapping. I'm just saying. Hey, just. <laughs> Bruce is really good. Adam was saying. Bruce was really good. Bruce, Bruce, sang a really cool song in uh, Spanish, I think, some other language. So that was really cool. I forget that he's fluent in uh, rolling backwards in another language, bilingual. But um, it was fun. We rode uh, real late again, and uh, we got to sleep in for three, almost four hours again. So that was nice sleeping in. And um, Marco needs to work on his people skills very badly. And uh, I'm going to pass the mic over to Morgan. So, Morgan, um, after sleeping in for four hours, how could you possibly sleep anymore? More sleep. All right. Pass it back to... Uh, we'll, we'll just go right around the we'll, oh. we'll pass it over to the guy who's making fun of me. Hey. Um... My highlight from uh, last night was probably, uh, I didn't see a whole lot of what was going down, but the locals just blasting and getting, like, inches away from the rafters every single time, hitting the hip, like, they must have just had this, like, wall of, uh, of something in front of their face the whole time and just not getting phased, um, and then watching uh, Tobias blast the hip and getting real close to the lights and the rafters as well, and then uh, Tobias... Uh, also, uh, somehow managed to get a splinter, like eight inches long, in his uh, in his the cheek of his buttocks, uh, yeah. and then, <laughs> that was just pretty pretty wild. <laughs> yeah, he ripped his his pants, his underwear, and then had a splinter like a, a thick, long splinter in his in his butt cheek. So uh, that was my highlight. <laughs> so um, here's uh, here's Jay Clug. Uh, I don't know, two things that stood out in my mind from the night were uh, Dominic ice grinding from the vert wall into the five foot quarter. It was like a 20 foot ice grind. And the other thing was Chris Doyle jumping from the hip into the mini ramp. And he also turned down it. That was pretty incredible to see. And I don't know, besides that, all the locals shredding. Uh, one kid, Jared, can't remember his last name, did a, Jared Dragon did a manual to 180 tail whip. That was pretty crazy. But besides that, it was just fun to ride with everyone. It was a real good vibe and a real good park overall. Shut up, Adam. <laughs> um, besides trying not to murder Adam this whole trip, it's been really good. But um, I hate you. <laughs> I just spit all over the mic. Yeah, what are you doing? <laughs> eat them. Don't eat them. Quiet. Just would you? Not talking. Alright, so anyways, anyways, I'm having a blast. 
Um, ramp rider session was unbelievable. I pretty much missed probably six real good things, but I saw people trying them and I heard people clap when people did them. So I was just like, oh no, like I'd like, cause I'd be like looking at people trying stuff and I don't know. I missed Carl Ice picking up the rail. I missed um, Nyquist and um, Zach Zach Warden toothpicking the big sub box. Uh, Miss Doyle jump into the spine. <laughs> um, Were you even but, at the skate park? Yeah, I kind of for for me being at the skate park, I kind of had something to prove with the curve wall, and it like made me really mad, and I hit that a million times and got really mad and crashed a couple times trying to X up around it and then I decided that I don't like being angry and that the rest of the park was too good to just waste myself on one obstacle so I went outside and freaked out for a little while and like decided that I don't want to be pissed off riding anymore and so then I went in and sessioned a little bit watched some stuff go down had a blast um and I can't talk when Adam's taunting me. <laughs> but anyways, um, I don't know. Then I found out I found another thing I wanted to do, and then that took me like two hours or something stupid. And I was just determined to not get pissed. And I don't know. We rode till like two thirty in the morning. Saw a bunch of amazing stuff. A bunch of really good locals, and everybody was really cool. Um, I don't know, that's about it. Got back to the room real late, crashed in here, woke up and it was raining, and now we're going to Nashville. So that's about it. Um, trip's been great, like, better than good. <laughs> here you go, catfish. Now back to catfish, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks, Matt. Thanks for paying attention, all of you guys out there at RideBMX.com. Stay tuned. Lots more updates from the road. Rock and roll road. What's it called? I don't know anymore. This thing that you're watching, it's we're on it. Later. <laughs>